Hey friends, welcome to another music class. This is Mr. Daniel, and I hope you guys are doing great at home. Before we start this lesson, I want to do a little recap from the past few weeks. We started talking about the family instruments, and we divided them into four sections. Percussion, strings, brass, and woodwind. We talked about music and instruments from different countries. Music of Africa. We talked about how they're really good with percussions and drums. Music of Spain, they have the castanets, have maracas, and bandurria, which is a small type of guitar to make their music. Music of Italy, they're really good with classical music and orchestra, and they have the cello and the mandolin. So today, we're going to be talking about music of Mexico. The foundations in the traditional music of Mexico are very different from the Western style played today. The music of Mexico has a wide range of different styles, from ranchera to mariachi and even rock music. But mariachi is the most played music style in Mexico. Even here, when you go out in a restaurant, Mexican restaurant, you most likely will be listening to mariachi music. In order to play the style, there's different instruments. One of the main ones is the guitarrón mexicano. Guitarrón mexicano, which is kind of like a guitar. The guitarrón mexicano is a much larger than the average guitar. It is almost twice its size. It has a shorter neck and a rounded back. The guitarrón mexicano is typically played in a mariachi band. They also have maracas. Kind of like Spain, they use maracas to make their music. The original maracas were made of wood and filled with seeds and beans. They create a rattling sound when shaken. They also have flauta de tres hoyos. Flauta de tres hoyos. The English translation of flauta de tres hoyos is a three hole flute. That is exactly what this Mexican instrument is. It is smaller than other flutes and is played with only one hand. Some musicians will play a percussion instrument along with it, such as a bell or a maraca. So today we're going to add a few instruments to our family of instruments here. We already have the maracas, so we're not going to put that again. So we already have maracas. So, but we're going to add the guitarrón mexicano, which is a it's a type of guitar. So the guitar does have strings. So that will put the guitarrón in the strings family. So we're going to put guitarrón here. Guitarron. And we're going to put the three hole flute in one of the sections. The flute is not a percussion, it's not a string, it's not made out of brass or metal, it's made out of wood. So the flauta de hoyos is going to belong to the woodwind family. That's going to be our first woodwind instrument. Okay? So I want to put a three hole flute right here. Three, all, blue. Alright, so those are all our instruments. And I don't have a three hole flute, but I do have a recorder. And of course, the difference is uh, the recorder has most, um, more notes to, um, available to play. Lauta de Tres Odios, of course, only has three notes. But I found a song that we all know that actually the third graders are learning this song right now. The song is Mary Had a Little Lamb. And for that, you only need to know how to play three notes on the recorder. So that would be a song that you could probably play with the Lauta de Tres Odios, with the three hole flute. So I'm going to play that song for you. That's the song with the recorder. And to finish this lesson, uh, I want to play one more song for you. And I'm going to play the guitar. And I don't have a guitarrón mexicano, like a big Mexican guitar, but I have a regular guitar here. And
And I'm gonna play a song that you probably know for from the movie Coco. And the song is Un Poco Lo. So you probably heard the song, it's in Spanish. So that's gonna give you a bigger idea of what kind of um, music is what they play in Mexico. It's gonna, I'm gonna play in a, in a mariachi style, okay? I'm gonna get it ready.